Hey guys, welcome to Prince of Peace Tarot. I'm Justin, and today I will be doing a quick read for the zodiac sign of Scorpio. So if you have Scorpio in your sun, moon, rising, or Venus, or anywhere within your chart, this reading may resonate with you. If you are dealing with a Scorpio, this reading can resonate. And if it does, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Okay guys, before we get into your reading, let's say a prayer. Okay. Infinite Creator, Olo Dumare, to my higher self, my Ori, Eshu, Obatala, to the Agum Marine Laie, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, to my benevolent ancestors, known and unknown, Florine Williams, Norman Williams, thank you for allowing me to source the most accurate reading for the sign of Scorpio. Okay, guys. Scorpio, let's do you. Okay, at the bottom of the deck, we got the Hermit. Somebody feels lonely. Um, and at the top, we got the Hermit in reverse. Hermit in reverse. Somebody is feeling lonely. Um, and at the top, we have the King of Pentacles. Somebody's wealthy. All right. I feel like those are two different masculine energy, Scorpio. I want to say that's your past person and that's your new person. Because I told you last time in your last reading that you were going to meet um, an entrepreneur, someone whose money was very, very good, someone ambitious, fun. Um, and uh, I, I know I said you might get married, but there's definitely stability within the um, King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles is usually married, just like the Queen of Pentacles. So those are your two people. Let's start off in your spread. The top row, we got the Five of Wands in the upright, Devil in reverse, Four of Wands in the upright, Five of Cups in reverse. Uh, five of Wands, is this is not your energy. I mean, it could have been that the person that you were with in the past brought you a lot of conflict, made you feel like you were in a competition with, with other people. Um, the devil in reverse doesn't tell me that like this person released that energy. It tells me that this person is a immature soul um, and they will actually hold on to these um, traits, these negative, obsessive traits. Um, this person won't realize, won't stop being the way they are until the day they die. OK, so don't don't even think that they'll change. They won't. Um, four of Wands, Five of Cups. I feel like this person sees you having stability, um, actually having something very stable, and they regret that. They regret that they didn't couldn't have that with you. That's what I'm seeing. This The first row feels like all of their energy. Um, and then that Four of Wands is like yours, but they're like looking at it, okay? Um, then we got the Four of Pentacles in the upright. We're starting in your second row now. Four pinnacles in the upright, page of cups in the reverse, two of wands in the upright, nine of swords in the reverse. Um, the four pinnacles says that to me that you are, your money is, your money is stable now too. Their structure, see, I think last time I said that your partner is bringing you structure and they still are. They, the, the energy is still there of structure, of wealth building. Um, everything is looking really good for you, Scorpio, um, and looking bad for your past person. A page of Cups in Reverse just lets me know that that past person played games with you in love, kept a lot of people on the side. Um, yeah, just very immature. Like the, the devil is sitting right above the Page of Cups uh, and is telling me it's just they're confirming the immaturity of this person. Immaturity on a soul level, 3D physical level. This person just, they got to grow up. So Two of Wands tells me that um, you are, you're making a choice. You're branching out. You're leaving this person behind. Two of Wands also could be significant of the person that you're with. Like you could be moving to live with them. Like I said, this person is still showing up like an entrepreneur, still showing up very ambitious. Um, and actually the Four of Wands sits over your Two of Wands. That's six. Four and two is six. Six is equal give and take. That's harmonious. That's love. So there's love here for you. Um, Nine of Swords in reverse tells me that your past person is who's feeling regret because the regret is sitting over that is healing very slow. It's taking them a long time to heal. OK, then at the bottom, we got five of swords in the reverse, the star in the reverse, eight of swords in the upright justice in the reverse. Five of swords tells me that this person in the future will be coming to you with conflict, um, arguments, is to me that's not usually making amends because five of swords this person is angry period this person is angry um yeah they should drop them swords and leave it alone but the uh 
They probably are because the star in reverse is like a lack of hope, lack of faith. They don't really see you coming back to them. I don't think you are either. Eight of Swords tells me that they have negative thoughts. They're in like a negative thought prison. They feel like a victim. They feel, do you want to know why they feel like a victim? Because justice in reverse, karma. They're receiving their karma. They feel like it's an injustice, but it is their justice. And let me tell you why. We got, um, numbers are good with you on this one. Your numbers are, I see four, four for you. 44 is, you, four is our stability. Stability, I see 88. 88 tells me, um, you, everybody in the spread, you and your past person is getting what they deserve, whether it be good karma or bad karma. You're obviously getting the good karma because uh, your fours are all in the upright. They represent your your stability and your wealth. Like I said, that structure is there. The, just this, just like last reading, when I said that um, this person brings structure, they really do. Like you really, this is the second reading that says like, you finally get it. And also what this is telling me is that, um, nobody's going to be able to take this from you. Like your past person, nobody like this is being protected by spirit. That's protection. There's protection here. Um, yeah, that that's it. You're, you're protected. Your money's good. Your past person won't change. I see five, five of ones, five of cups, five of swords, five, five, five. That's change. Everything's changed for you and them. So life is going to look different or is looking different for you right now in 2021, Scorpio. Um, yeah, just be thankful and grateful for this new stability that you are either in or coming to. All right, that is your quick read. If you want to book a personal, email me at princeofpeacetarot at gmail.com. Okay, see ya.